y'all, it is hotter than fish grease out here. Oh my God. So I'm vlogging on my cell phone for right now, but it is hot. Oh my God, it's 105 degrees, y'all. It's 105 degrees. Um, yeah, this is this is ridiculous. My car is filthy. So I'm gonna go to the car wash first. Oh my goodness, this is ridiculously hot. Okay, so y'all, I'm back. Um, this little, the spa was nice. Um, it's black owned as uh as well, and it was super nice. I mean, they still need to do the decorating and everything. It was at bare bones at this point, but the services that they are offering is, you know, good good services. Um, I did book uh five sessions well it's it's kind of it's four sessions but five um procedures basically so i'm going to be doing the um lipo cavitations to the abdomen so i'm going to be getting my um getting the cavitation for my stomach and then i'm going to be doing underneath my chin area as well on one of the sessions so i booked four sessions and then the uh the uh the chin like it's a cavitation but it's directed towards the chin area to thin out your uh chin area so now i'm actually on my way to ulta um to see if i can find ruby woo lipstick because i have the lipstick already but i like to have double lipsticks because i like to have stuff in my purse like i want to have my lipstick in my purse as well as at home like i don't want to have to you know either or so usually when i get stuff like lipsticks or something like that lipsticks especially lipsticks i get two or if i have like a gloss that i really like um i'll get two um but yeah so i'm gonna go look for another ruby woo and also has some mac um products but not much they don't have like the whole line of mac so i'm just gonna go around in there and see if they have it so right next door is my store home goods so um i'll probably run into home goods as well so again this vlog is on my phone well the whole vlog won't be on my phone but this part of the vlog will be on my phone but i'm so excited to see um the med spa it's like right in my close to where I live it's I told them they're gonna they're gonna be seeing me okay so yeah I told them that they're gonna be seeing me in there because they do like the um infusions like the yeah they do like infusions and everything like the uh, IV infusions so they're gonna be doing that those um they got the myers drip they have um they got b12 shots they got it's a lot of stuff so much that i should have i should have grabbed the pamphlet but i didn't um everything is online though so yeah you're in the i guess west side of houston um kd cypress area go ahead and um i will put their link in the description and y'all can check it out but my husband's calling right now so i'll check back with y'all later yeah 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 uh, i 
wake up, I go ball, I go hard with my dogs, bet it all, what's the call? Need a ten, never fall, polo socks, polo jaws, keep it ten, beat the eyes in my life. Okay, y'all, so I'm on my way to the grocery store. I'm on my way. Hey, guys, welcome back to another day in the vlog. It is, um, oh, shit. Shoot. Oh. It's um Sunday, and I'm on my way to the grocery store. It's actually almost 7 o'clock at night. Yeah, I'm just picking up the camera. Um... I did film a little get ready with, get ready with me. I don't like how that came out. So like I said, I'm going to the grocery store and I just wanted to have a little chit chat with you, just a small little chit chat with y'all. So I've decided to start a leveling up journey. It's mid year, y'all know. Um, you haven't haven't reached your goals that you have uh, set out for yourself for the beginning of the year and you're nowhere near them you just have to re reevaluate some things that you're doing and what is stopping you from reaching your goals and I'm talking to y'all but I'm actually talking to myself like what is it that caused me not to be where I wanted to be and I, fi I figured out for me it's the distractions. It's my cell phone. It's the distractions of watching other people's content, not um, not doing my own content. And I can't even say that I don't I don't make the content. I second guess myself, and I make a lot of content. I do I don't post it. If you see me in real life, every time you look around, I have a camera in my hand. Or either I have my phone out. Every time I go to a store, every time I'm at a restaurant, I'm filming. And I never get to the point where as I'm sitting down and I'm editing. Like, what is what is the problem? And it's sometimes I feel like I know if I do it, I'm going to succeed. I don't, like, don't want to sound cocky or anything like that. <laughs> But that sometimes I feel that way and I feel like I can slack because I know when I put something out there, it's gonna go, it's gonna do good. That's in my brain, I think, you know, it's gonna do good. And if it don't, I'm okay with that. But um, a lot of times I look at other people's content and I didn't know, like, how do you get these pop-ups to come? I want my stuff to pop, I want stuff to pop up on mine. You know, I'm using iMovie. And I'm just sick of my quality looking so bummy. Like, ugh, why is mine not looking like theirs? I can't find those settings and this and that and that and the other. But I'm steady watching their content and I'm not focusing on what I need to do to figure out what in the world they are doing. It's like, lady, either ask somebody or get on YouTube or Google it and find out what is this thing. I don't even know what it was called. Like, I just knew it was pop-ups. And every time I put pop-ups or fonts, or something like it wouldn't come up but I say all this to say I haven't been crushing my goals because I'm looking for a standard of my videos and not just working on it little by little I'm trying to create 45 minute vlogs when the only thing I need to do is put a 10 minute vlog I feel like I, I, I play myself sometimes well, I'm to the grocery store and so welcome to my TED talk Look at these fiddly figs. They are humongous. I wish I had the light in my house to put these in there. Like, I got plans, but I don't think these would be mad at me if I put them home. <laughs> Back and cry. 
I can't. just threw on this little linen tonic tunic dress and I have on like an all-in-one kind of like bodysuit halter top is that what they call halter top no tube top but it's like all-in-one but anyways I wear that only in the house or if I'm going somewhere like this I'll throw something in over it and it looks like I have biking shorts on but I had took a nap baby I got the b12 shot and everything but that acai bowl and that uh, avocado toast, baby. I got home and was like, <sighs> I didn't sleep good last night. That's another reason why, because I only got like four hours of sleep. So yeah, but I, when I woke up and I tried to look at my phone, oh, my eyesight was horrible, horrible. So I barely can make out just even the pictures in the phone and maybe because I went to sleep with my makeup on and everything but I do ha I do find that I do that a lot and so um, I have reading glasses but I when I purchased them the last time I got like the minimum uh, strength and so I just came back up to Walgreens and picked me up another pair and I just want to show y'all this because I've had these the last time too, but like I said, the strength is horrible. Like I be out at a restaurant and still struggling. So, um, if you don't know, when you hit 40, your eyesight starts to go. Keep living. So once you hit 40, your the muscle in your eyes are strained, and sometimes it might be one goes before the other. It just depends. Um, for me, I started. I went to Ross and tried on. Uh, dress and it scratched my the cornea in my eye and that's when my eyesight started really messing up and I started from being 20-20 vision to just like horrible vision so anyways long story short um, I found these foster grants at Walgreens and usually they have a sale on them like right now they have a sale on them buy one get one free and the normal price for them was $34.99 um, these are the glasses right here. They're a tortoise shell. I like how big they are. Because, you know, a lot of reading glasses, they like really skinny and stuff. But the reason why these are big is because these, right, these are uh, multifocal. Jesus. These are mo mo multifocal and, well, multifocal plus. So, basically, um... They're reading glasses. They have blue, the blue, um, blue light shield, as well as interactive. That means that you can keep them on and it won't be blurry. You know, like reading glasses usually be. You know, the girls didn't know. No, 
um so when you're, you're sitting around talking to somebody you won't have to keep let me show y'all what the librarians used to do you don't have to do that because even like in my uh car i can see all of the functions and they're clear the dashboard is clear everything that's in my immediate surrounding is clear you can see the blue light tint and my eyes are red that's because i just woke up but um but yeah i wanted to show y'all that because the last time i went to the eye doctor they wanted to make me basically buy multifoc uh bifocals bifocal multifocal or whatever and they wanted to charge me for the frame for the prescription and it was just it was a lot of money when i say a lot of money it was going upwards to four hundred dollars and i'm like okay so now that i see that they sell these like if i look down like this like like if i go like this even i don't have to go like that but if i was to look up like this i can see it still see out further without it being jeez so now i'm gonna go uh go luxury shopping arrived at our luxury store because this is ghetto <laughs> this is ghetto not five and below having a hot girl summer guys so i decided to just pop into my beauty room just to show y'all what i'm wearing so i purchased this uh jumper from burlington i got the bag from burlington a, a while back um i did pick up these earrings from target the other day excuse the dirty mirror <laughs> i have this pendant and this chain came from a friend of mine she owns an etsy shop and she makes hand hand uh, made jewelry and um it's the name of her shop is pieces of me by altina sims i'll link it in the description below i have on my miller bracelet that i i really don't take it off um and this bangle from h m i have my uh hand sanitizer the bottle i picked the bottle case i picked up from bath and body works I also have on my Tory Burch slides. And then I have this gold anklet that I purchased from um, Amazon, which is 24 karat. I think it's like, it might be 14 karat gold, but it has not faded. Um, it's been on my ankle for like maybe two months now. And I love it. It hasn't faded. Like I said, it was a good steal. I think it was like $13 or something, but it, it really, it's, it's, held, it's holding up. It is actually holding up. Oh, y'all, I cannot balance myself. But yeah. So, I'll link that in the description below as well. Um, so yeah, again, y'all, I cut my hair. So that's that. So let's go ahead and hand, head on out. I've decided to pick up my phone to vlog off of that's why i'm going to upgrade my phone because i'm just going to start vlogging on my phone i think that it's easier it's less intimidating when walking into stores i just i don't know my uh canon um m50 is so big and bulky you can't fit it in my i can't fit it in my purse like i would never be able to fit that in my purse so um yeah i'm just gonna start vlogging off of my phone um so i need more storage and i need um be a better quality camera so um if y'all thinking about making youtube videos y'all pick up your phone um like i said i have a canon m50 I actually have two of the mugs <laughs> um long story on how that happened but um i'll do my sit down videos just dedicated videos something like that um with my m50 and just go ahead and continue to vlog on my um iPhone. I should have turned the camera around doing all of this, but okay, we're gonna head out the house. It's hot as hell, y'all. Texas is hot.
Texas is hot. I just went outside and came back in and it's just like, do I really want to do this? But let's go. Peace. I almost forgot to tell y'all what scent of the day I decided to put on. If you're looking for a good summer summer scent, this Kenzo Flowers by Kenzo. Ooh, baby, this one. This is just the original, just the original. I know that they have another bottle that looks like this one. Um, this is the red carnation that's on it. Is it a carnation or a hibiscus? Girl, I don't know. It's this flower right here with the long stem. Um, yeah, but it's flowers. Flowers by Kenzo. Bomb. If you like that powdery scent, if you like like a powdery, a powdery scent, hold on. If y'all like that powdery kind of a scent, like very fresh and airy, Flowers by Kenzo. That's the that's that's the move, and it pairs so well with other um, perfumes. Is my eyebrows too dark? I've been using like a black liner on my eyebrows, and I feel like it's just a little bit too dark. I don't know. I felt that my hair is jet black. I wanted to do jet black eyebrows, but I think I'm going to go back to brown. I'm not feeling it. And then I really don't have any makeup on right now. Well, I have makeup on, but it's more of the J-Lo. This, I have more of the J-Lo um, beauty. Um, it's like a glowy bronzer. And then I just put my Laurier Mercier. Why do I always meant Laura Mercier? Um, translucent powder in medium deep all over my face. Um, of course, that's all over my sunscreen. So I don't really have foundation on, but I love how that bronzer just bronzes my face and just blot that uh, Laura Mercier on. Not feeling my lip. Not feeling my eyebrows, but I gotta go. That's it is what it is. I'm so sorry. We're out for real. I need a tag. I need a tag. I need a tag. I need a tag. Unless you talking numbers, we ain't speaking about the right things. Switch up on my nigga for a figure. That's not like me. Baddie with a body. Oh, guys, I am back at home. Oh, we had an ordeal. I hope y'all can see me. I don't have no light on me or anything. So I think I'm just going to sit here on my floor. <sighs> there we go. Got some. There we go. Some light. <laughs> Let me see if I can. Get my... <sighs> Hold on. right here yeah phones are so easy to work with when you vlog them. so I went on ahead and picked up two things actually it's three things from my well I went to T-Mobile um, that's my carrier so yeah, so I picked up, first of all, why am I showing this first? Okay, so I got my iPhone. It is the Pro Max, um, is it called the Pro Max? Yeah, the iPhone 13 Pro Max. Um, I got it in the color gold. I don't wanna, I'm not gonna uh, use it until I purchase my cover and my, um, my, okay, wait. I'm not gonna use it until after I get my case and my protective, my screen protector. So while I was there, I was basically talking to getting the iPhone watch, well, iWatch. I um, I'm gonna open this, but yeah, so I got the iWatch and this is my second time having one. My first one I gave away to my daughter. She had really wanted one and I wasn't really wearing it, but that was before they had came out with all these little cute gadgets and stuff that you can put on them. So 
Um, I don't know if my camera is this way or this way. Which way am I looking? I think it's this way. But yeah, so um got another iWatch. I don't know what the specs is or whatever on them. I don't know, but I plan on ordering like some bands and um, face covers and stuff like that from Amazon as well. So I'm probably do that later on tonight. I have not eaten anything today. I haven't eaten today and I have not, I didn't have no coffee today. I didn't eat today. I just been drinking water. At least I'm hydrated, but yeah, I'm gonna get ready to leave the house again. Um, and go find me something to eat. I don't know if I wanna go sit in a bar and just, you know, get me something to eat. Um, or if I wanna go to a restaurant. I don't know what I wanna do right now. I definitely don't feel like cooking. So then there's that. Um, it's getting pretty late, so it's gonna be a limited uh, places that I can go to if I keep continuing to wait so yeah but that's what I'm about to do I'm gonna um I'm gonna go ahead and pick y'all back up when I get there I know my energy is so low like I said I have not eaten anything I'm starving right now um I went through so much with this situation right here I don't I'm too embarrassed to even tell y'all what had happened um and then with the iPhone 3, I know I'm late to the party, y'all, because I think the 14, because I asked him when was the 14 coming out, he was like, it's rumored to come out in November. So I'm late to the party on the 13, and that's okay, because I had 11, and I've made it all the way to the end of 13. So I'm going to be okay when they get to 20. But then I had to buy um, the the booty, what they call it, the uh, the wall the wall charger because they changed the USB and it's a different kind of plug. So I know y'all, this is boring to y'all because this is just exciting to me because it's new to me. But yeah, so I'm finna, I'm finna. Is that even a word? I'm about to um, hook this up and then I'll go ahead and head out the door to go find me something, a late night snack from somewhere. I don't know yet. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna pick y'all back up um, cause it's pretty late and yeah, I can just go and go get something to eat. If anything is exciting, I'll pick the phone back up and start uh, continuing with this vlog. But as for now, I'll see y'all on Saturday. Um, I have to make my plans and see where it goes. I have nothing planned so far. I actually was supposed to be going to a birthday party tonight, but I don't feel like doing nothing really, honestly. I just want to be at my house. I like my house. I like my house. You like your house? I like my house. I want to be at home. Okay. But I'll check y'all in the morning. Good afternoon, everyone. Today is Saturday. Again, a late start. It is six o'clock in the afternoon. I'm getting ready to head out to Target because I wanna get some um, protection for my phone. So I'm gonna go try to find a cute little neutral phone case um, for my phone, as well as um, see if they have like uh, some cute watch um, bands and stuff. I said I was gonna order some from off Amazon, but I don't know. I'm gonna see what they have over there though. But um, hopefully I can at least get a phone case and a shield protector for my um, screen. So, yeah. But this is, let me see. Messy in here. <laughs> so this is what I got on today. It's just giving plain in the house. I'm stepping out to go in and you know, get some stuff. Um, I have these girl, the beauty supply kickers on. And I have my Bella sunshades on. Um, I just basically took my scarf off my hair and just brushed these BDBs back here. <laughs> and that's about all. I'm loving the minimalness of my hair. Chef's kiss. Okay, let's go ahead and head out into this Texas heat, baby. 
Said I never changed and leveled up. I guess I lied, yeah. Off that strain of potent just to feel like I'm alive, yeah. Mix that with that potion just to feel like I'm that guy, yeah. So know the one you talking to, you way outside your line, yeah. Go against the tribe, you lose your. Let me not even say this shit. I just ran out of my patience. I just got tired of waiting and got here myself. Niggas want me to believe in the dream that they see for they suffer still doubting themselves. They might as well light up the L. High top on 10 toe, drip retro. Talking major plays, hella high tech through the getro. Pin game, been petro. Just set it in the flesh hole. Send a text mail to give a wet clothes. On the paper wave to make a drip drip with the left low in the left stroke. I'ma make plays, I'ma go long. Never look back so so long. Yeah, flex up, yeah, flex up. Shawty on 10 for the go up, bring that to the crib and show love. Yeah, flex up, yeah, I'ma make plays, I'ma go long. Never look back so so long. I need a plan, flex up, I need a check, yeah. Shawty on 10 for the go up, bring that to the crib and show love. Hey, come from the pit, I'm out of the trench, my nigga. We look at the dread, my nigga. We ran, she all on my way. I never let them play me, but they claiming that they know my songs. I tell them quote the lines until I'm goaded, bitch, I'm going off. Loyal to my soil and the culture, I'm that chosen one. I just got her back, she wanna fuck, I think she know I'm star. I can't do no wrong, look in her eyes, she wouldn't know I'm scarred. They try to justify me going up like they don't know he raw. Off of that doge, just fuck what they told you, I'm never sober. Gripping the split for the chip on my shoulder, trying to decode this. They label me thug, I keep it a buck, I don't give a fuck about it. Out of the mud, it's showing me love, my nigga, what's up? Out of my way, bitch, I need the paper. Fuck what you want, I mean, I know later. I keep it short with the conversation. Out of my lane, the crew got a brain in the cockpit with no hands on it. I've been the man with the plan, homie. Put that to the man with the bands on me and a passport with the stamps on it. Yeah. I'ma make plays, I'ma go long. Never look back so, so long. Yeah. 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 Shawty on 10, finna go up. Bring that to the crib and show love. Yeah. I'ma make plays, I'ma go long. Never look back for so long. I need a plan. Next up, I need a chance. Yeah. Shawty, I'm dancing and going. Bring that to the crib and show love. I need a bag, yeah. I need a tag, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, basically to the boardwalk. And so I just ran home and came right back out. I went and got all my groceries out the trunk because tomorrow we're doing, um, what is it called? Wings and waffles, waffles and wings, whatever. Um, and yeah, so we're doing like a little brunch thing tomorrow. Um, so. Yeah, so I had to go drop those groceries off and then I came right back out and um, now I'm meeting her here. I think the kitchen is closing at 12 and I asked her was she here yet and she didn't text me back. So, well, what I'm about to do is just take, I end up getting the honey bun cookie. I'm just gonna eat just a piece of it because I am definitely on the diet and I'm trying to be gluten free. Well, next week I'm gonna be completely, next week all the way up into my trip, I'm gonna be gluten free and um, what do you call it? Gluten and dairy free. I'm gonna do gluten and dairy free um, next week and all the way up until it's time for me to leave on our trip. I don't know if I even mentioned that I'm just going on a trip to y'all. So. So yeah, I'm going back um, to Mexico, and yeah. So be looking for that footage coming in soon. It's gonna be coming in hot. <laughs> Signing out for right now. Peace out. Why is this thing so close up into my face? Mm -hmm.